hi guys welcome to my channel if this is your first time of seeing my face you're very welcome my name is oiza and i am the nigerian girl i'm a lifestyle vlogger based in the uk i'm going to be sharing with you guys in today's vlog a day in the life of a healthcare assistant i'm going to do my best to share as much details as i can i may not show you obviously my clients simply because i don't want to go to jail but i'm going to take you guys along as much as i can um so basically we have one client for this run and there are four calls in the day the first one is at 7 a.m second one is at 12 um third one is at 5 p.m and the last one for the day is at 7 p.m basically what we do is just help the clients with their personal care groom them feed them if possible administer drugs and just make sure they are feeling comfortable so yeah um i hope you enjoyed this vlog please remember to like share comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the vlog hi guys good morning um i have just packed my food made my tea I've packed snacks that i'll need throughout the day i've also made milk for tiara because obviously you know she's still breastfeeding so that's just to give my husband a soft landing so she doesn't disturb him too much um yeah i leave in about it's about 5 30 now i the bus has different times the first one is about 5 40 the second one 555 i think that's the one i'm aiming to catch so yeah i'm just about to leave the house now i thought to give you guys an update i'm going to show you what it's like how we drive back and forth and you know yeah let's see how the vlog goes <laughs> this is how dark it usually is when i leave the house and how dark it is when i come back you guys will see that's my bus stop over there <clears throat> So I'm actually here on time for the one, the, the bus at 4.41. just got into the bus station in Coventry I'm working with someone new today so he's meant to pick me up from the bus station and then we'll go for our first run I have about 20 minutes to wait because it says he'll be here at 6 at 7 and this is like 6 30 so yeah just finished the first call of the day and it wasn't too bad it wasn't too bad <laughs> okay so guys some of my colleagues want to say hi ali in particular yeah, hi we're done with the morning call exactly on our way back to office yeah so the next call is going to be for 12 p.m and i'll keep you guys updated The first 
first shift was good it was a bit exhausting but now i'm going to have my breakfast and wait until 12 the next call is for 12 so yeah almost time for the lunch call and I'm just about to leave the office That's fine. Or maybe say again? Any drink to this cookie? Oh no drink, no drink. I'm Any good. Cookie? No, no, no. Any bag with the carry bag for them? Um is the bag free? It is ten. Okay. Yeah, would you like to have any salad on it? Um not really a fan of salad. Maybe what's this? That is spinach. Okay, a little bit of this. This? Okay, yeah, I'll have that. You want sweet corn, onion? Sweet corn. Yeah. Yeah. Onion for you? No onion. Lettuce? No, no Any lettuce. sauce for you? What sauces are these? These are the sauces you have. This okay. Um. Okay, I'll have the um sticky sweet chili. Yeah. And then some chili flakes. Guys, so I'm still waiting and I went to get something to eat from the subway store just opposite the office. I'm so exhausted, honestly. This is the routine every day. Um, the longest wait time is like from 12 p.m. to like 5 p.m. Hi. From 12 p.m. to like 5 p.m. So it's kind of like a long wait. Okay, guys. So... I was so hungry, I had to go and get a subway. It's actually my first time trying a subway. And it's not bad. <clears throat> I wish I requested for like some chicken or beef. Because it just tastes bland. Like it's just pepperoni and some vegetables. But it's not bad. So I'm actually the only one here waiting. Mostly because today is a Friday. So like literally everyone has closed. Mm, it's so good. Mm. <laughs> mm. The bread is so crusty. That subway was so refreshing. Mm. Yeah, so basically, this is usually the routine. Nothing extremely strenuous or out of place. When we resume in the mornings, the first call is for 7 a.m. When you get to the client's house, get them out of bed, help them up to the commode, make breakfast for them, give them a bath. Mm, just generally make sure that they are doing okay or feeling comfortable. 
second call is for 12 p.m which is like lunch time get there make lunch for them find out if there's anything they need some of them are independent some of them are not so you administer drugs next call after then is 5 p.m which is tea time they call it tea time as the name implies you make tea for them probably change their pads bedtime which is for 7 p.m um you basically help them get into bed change them into their pajamas you know administer drugs it's kind of like the same routine there's nothing spectacular about it it's not easy <gasps> particularly for me because um i don't live in coventry i just come here for work i live in birmingham so after closing out I, I think the the last call will probably end at like 7 30 ish then i get back to the bus station and then from there to birmingham which is about 45 minutes or is it 45 minutes yeah 45 minutes because of all these stops the bus is going to make yeah and then i'll get home at say 8 8 30 to 9 weekends i usually drive because there's nobody in the office here as you can see like i'm alone in this in this whole floor i i, I would say the whole floor because i didn't see anybody when i was coming i can't hear any voices nothing so yeah, I'm just chilling here, waiting for my partner. The client's house is like 35 minutes away from here. And the next call is for 5 p.m. This is like 10 minutes past eight, uh, past four. So it would take us 35 minutes to get there. So obviously we have to leave like 4.20. During these times, I always wish that this evening call would go as fast as possible because I just want to get home to my family. I miss my baby girl so much but we're out here making the coin so she can have a better life <laughs> god help us and god bless the hustle so yeah that's pretty much you go